explain how circle hooks work. In order for a circle hook to do its job, it's got to go past the hinge of the jaw on the sailfish. Like if this is the sailfish's mouth, it's got to go down the hatch. That's why it's important when you get the bite, fish often swims off with it sideways in their mouth to give the reel a completely free spool. That means as light a pressure with your thumb as possible. Because what happens is they swim off with it and they flip it out like this and they swallow it. And if there's any pressure on the spool by your thumb, combined with the pressure of the line going through the water, it doesn't allow this hook to get past the hinge of the jaw and do its job. What happens most of the time is if you have pressure on there with your thumb, when they do that little flip like this to swallow it, it's gonna come right out of their mouth. That's why you pull back just ahead when you mess them. Free spool is, is all the way down, all the way free. So if the clicker's on, it gives you a little bit more leeway on dropping back to the fish. You don't have to keep so much pressure on it with your thumb, keep it from backlashing, because the clicker kind of does that for you. Um, it also gives you a visual alarm telling you when that fish has turned the bait in its mouth and started to speed up. Because usually when they flip it around and eat it, they change gears and they go a little faster and that clicker will go. That's when you want to slowly push the drag forward. You don't want to jam it forward and you never want to raise the rod tip until the fish is jumping. Because that means he's hooked. 